CBS4 Weather with Chief Meteorologist Craig Setzer. Weather-wise, pretty hot day today, and the only thing that breaks the heat, it's either the sea breeze or a few afternoon storms. We have them popping up out west now over the Everglades. Uh, you can see a little bit of rain there and some dark bases from our Everglades Holiday Park camera. 92 right now in Miami, 90 Fort Lauderdale, Hollywood, 787 in Key West. 7 on the stick in the scale, making it feel like 101 west wind. That's that warm air direction blowing about 9 miles an hour. Feels like temperatures everywhere from 95 to 101 going to see more warmth in the coming days, but not quite as hot by late in the week. And once again, that west wind allows the air to travel over land. I know it's Everglades, but it's still land and uh, heat the air up. And that west wind also keeps the sea breeze pretty much pinned at the coast. And that was where we would get our relief from any heat. See the satellite map through the day today also showing the effect of those west winds. The clouds moving from west to east and a few little afternoon showers popping up. The one thing I'm going to watch through the evening is this thunderstorm complex up here that's been racing to the south now along the Treasure Coast. Here it is on the radar just to the southeast of Melbourne. And sometimes when these come down, they collide with a few of these little thunderstorms coming in from the Everglades and can produce some brief, strong thunderstorms. So we'll watch that as we go through the evening right now, though. There's a little bit of activity right down the middle of the peninsula and one little shower that's popped up just about over Davie there in 595 moving to uh, 441. There's the turnpike right there. So a little bit of rain uh, for your evening commute, but for the moment, not too widespread. Moisture is in place for these mainly late afternoon and evening thunderstorms. It's going to last through Wednesday with that west wind continuing even into Thursday. But by Friday, some deeper moisture comes up from the south. So we'll see a little bit better chance for thunderstorms scattered around. Also, a wind pattern changes, so uh, not that hot, hot air. Just Typical summertime humidity. Temperatures across the country hot all the way to the Canadian border. 80s up to uh, southern Canada, 86 in Minneapolis, but relatively comfortably cool in the northeast and in some places a little bit on the chilly side, only 53 right now in Boston. Our forecast for tonight, some evening storms uh, here and there, mainly in Broward. Quiet otherwise overnight, a low near 76. For tomorrow, look for hot sun once again, some late day storms possible. High temperature near 93. It feels like temperatures once again around 100. For boaters, west southwest winds averaging 10 to 15, stage 1 to 2 feet near shore light chop on the base through the rest of the week we turn down the thermostat just a little bit but we also turn off our chances for rain by the end of the week back to you